the morning routine. Everyone says that they have a perfect morning routine. I think I have nailed it. There's a few rules when it comes to the morning routine. The first one is waking up at 7 a.m. has been the perfect time to wake up. You can get more done, has more productivity, and you have a lot more time before anyone else. The very first thing you do is not check your phone for 30 minutes. That's really important, and you definitely do not want to have any type of distractions as soon as you wake up, so don't check that phone. The very next thing would be to meditate. So find a place that's really peaceful that you can go to meditate and really wake up with the day. Super quiet, nice and peaceful, and you can really win the day. The next thing would be to be grateful. So being grateful actually brings you in tune with the source. So you want to make sure that you're grateful and you have plenty of things to be grateful for. The very next thing would be to read. So reading is really important because you can get it out of the way in the morning. And I have a few of my favorite places that I suggest you read. And working out. So you want to get the body moving so that way you can get the brain moving and get more productivity. So after the workout, we've actually found that five in the morning is the best time to do your waking up. So you can get more done at five in the morning. It's before anyone else is awake, before the sun's even up, and you can really win the day. You're not done laundry. Where's mine? Mike's sleeping. Exactly. So go to bed. No, because he's not gonna deal with it. I I'm not going to I'll just have but even after further review, we found that three in the morning is really the perfect time to wake up because you can get so much more done. And it's a, it's a beautiful time to wake up before even the birds start chirping. But even after further review, we found that waking up never, actually not sleeping at all, is really the best thing to do. You want to, you want to just take naps uh, throughout the whole day. You can have the more productivity, you can, you can get a lot more done. <laughs> okay, so just to be real, we've, we've gone through a lot of different scenarios. We woke up a few times at these ridiculous hours. And a lot of people will tell you a lot of different things, but you have to find out what's going to work for you. I would really recommend just doing whatever, you know, you feel good doing, especially with uh, being creative. As soon as you get into the competitive mode, that's when you start to lose traction and start to get burnout and things like that. You don't want to rush through things. You want to do things fast, but you want to stay in the creative mode the whole time. So as long as you're staying creative, getting enough sleep, I really think that's a perfect morning routine. If you have a perfect morning routine, if you have something to add to this list, go ahead and add that. Otherwise, like, share, comment, and we'll see you on the next one.